This is a demonstration on multicast and uh, you have a multicast server and you have a multicast receiver. Now in the normal way of things you would obviously have numerous multicast receivers coming from one server. Uh, this is a um, this is a Linux uh, operating system. This one is two. It's Lubuntu, and it's uh, version 18. So these are both Lubuntu distributions. Now over here we've got a PC, which is just for connectivity reasons, just for checking out. This is on 10.1.1.3 and this is the multicast server on 10.1.1.1 and the multicast receiver on 10.1.1.2 this router here is not switched on and it's not going to be used for this demonstration the um, the multicast range that you have is uh, 224.0.0.0 reserved and that range goes up to 239.255.255.255. Now for the demonstration, I'm going to use this address, 232.7.7.7, and with a port number of 5004. Just a little bit about the, uh, the screens that I'm going to show you is uh, the multicast server is going to have a red background and the multicast receiver is going to have a blue background. What I will do is just make sure that I've got ping connectivity between the devices and this makes sure that the stream will be able to flow correctly between the two and through the switch. Okay so let's just uh, Pull now the multicast server up and let's just check that we've got ping connectivity to the receiver. So it's ping and it's uh, 10.1.1.2 for the receiver. So this is not uncommon. I've had this quite a while where you ping and it doesn't go through. So what I'm going to do is go over to the client and I'm going to ping back the other way. Ping 10.1.1.1. So I do have connectivity there, and now I've got connectivity backwards. So sometimes you do experience this where you need to wake up the devices, and uh, and that's one of the problems that I experienced. So on the this is the receiver. And I'm going to go to System uh, Sound and Video, VLC Media Player. Now I want to open up a stream to this device. So let's go over to the server. Let's go to the Sound and Video, VLC Media Player. So this is going to be the device that streams to the other device. So on this device, I'm selecting media, I'm selecting stream, I'm going to go and add a file that I want to stream. So I'm selecting the stream, press open. This uh, tells you the uh, file that you're going to stream. And let's select stream. So click next. I'm selecting to display locally the file, so the file will play in the window as it's streamed, and select file RTP MPEG transport stream, and select add. The stream I'm going to send to is 232.7.7.7. Dot seven dot seven dot seven with a port number of five double oh four 
and my stream. Okay, so click next. I'm going to deactivate the transcoding and select next. Okay, before I select stream, I'm going to go back to the client machine. I'm going to make sure that this is configured to receive the stream by selecting media and selecting open network stream. Now the item is already configured with the address required. So just to be clear what you do need is RTP two dots colon whack whack two three two dot seven dot seven dot seven colon port number five double o four okay so make sure you've got the correct uh, address in there okay and press play so what you'll notice is that nothing's playing at the moment but across the bottom it looks like you've got a moving bar which um, signifies that it's ready to re receive the stream what I'm going to go back it to this uh, and just make sure that I've got ping connectivity which I do and go to the server make sure I've got ping connectivity which I do so now I'm going to click stream okay the video is streaming now so fingers crossed on the receiver I also have the what brings you to the file game? being streamed over so the server is streaming to the multicast address and the receiver is receiving the file a dangerous quest for a no so some some key takeaways that you've got to make sure that happens is that the uh, the server and client are both pinging each other and that they're both sort of awake now in the real world that might not happen it might not be that they uh, they don't need to to be woken up like I have to but um, in this demonstration it, it can be a bit finicky to get the two devices to receive the stream so thanks for coming to the video uh, give me a thumbs up and uh, write me a comment thank you